Are you ready to connect your domain name to your WP Engine powered website, but you're not sure if you should do it using the CNAME record or A records? In this video, we'll explain what these two types of records are and how to figure out which one you should use. Please note, WP Engine does not sell domain names, so you will need to access your domain provider account when you're ready to connect your domain to your website. Your domain provider is usually where you purchased your domain name. If you're not sure who your provider is, you can use the Who Is Lookup tool at whois.com slash whois to find out. Simply enter your domain name, click search, and then you'll see your provider listed at the top of the page under Registrar. Okay, let's get started. A CNAME is a type of DNS record or domain name system record that points one domain or subdomain to another domain. Here's an example. Let's say your preferred domain name is mywebsite.com, but you also want people who type the www subdomain with your domain name to be able to find your website. To make this happen, you can use a CNAME record to point www.mywebsite.com to mywebsite.com. When you do, anyone who types in either mywebsite.com or www.mywebsite.com will find your website. You can also use CNAME records to connect a root or apex domain name, in other words, a domain name like mywebsite.com that doesn't include www or any other subdomain, to a cloud-based service like WP Engine. This technique is called CNAME flattening and it's what allows you to point your root domain to a CNAME instead of an IP address. We'll explain what an IP address is in a moment. A records are a type of DNS record or domain name system record that points domain names to IP addresses. The A stands for address. An IP address is a unique numeric label assigned to a website or server. For example, a server's IP address could be something like 142.193.213.11. The IP address is considered to be the official address of that server. However, because it's not easy to remember strings of numbers that make up IP addresses, and because IP addresses sometimes need to change, we need to use human readable names for websites. In other words, domain names. So you can use A records to point your domain name to an IP address so people can find your website easily. Now that you know what each of these records are, you might be wondering which one you should use to connect your domain name to your WP Engine powered website. And the answer is, it depends. If your domain provider allows you to use the CNAME record to point your root or apex domain, or more specifically, they support CNAME flattening, this is what we recommend. If your provider does not, you can use A records because all providers support using them. Why do we recommend using the CNAME? Because it provides the best DNS experience in a seamless network connection. Although it's a rare occurrence, IP addresses are subject to change here at WP Engine. This means if you use A records to point your domain to an IP address, you may need to update your DNS if our IP addresses change in the future. But if you're able to use CNAME flattening, you won't need to update your DNS settings if our IP addresses change. So what's your next step? We recommend reaching out to your domain provider and asking them if they support CNAME flattening so you can use a CNAME to connect your root or Apex domain to your website on the WP Engine cloud-based platform. If they say yes, use that. If not, or if you're not absolutely certain that they do, use the A records instead. I want to share a note of caution here. Using the CNAME record to point your root domain with a provider that does not support this method can delay your website's go live process and disrupt other DNS records and the services that depend on them, like domain-based email. So 
it's important to confirm that your domain provider supports CNAME flattening before proceeding with this method. We hope this video has been helpful. If you have any questions or need additional assistance, check out our support center at my.wpengine.com support. You can also get to this page under Get Help. This is where you can search our help documentation and find other helpful resources. You can also reach out to our friendly support team. We're always here and ready to help.